Welcome to Factorio Mega Base in a Book. My name is Nilaus, and we are back here again on our weekly schedule. I know that I'm I'm so happy that so many of you are commenting like, "Oh, don't wait a week. I mean, I went more than once a week." And and thank you for that. Uh, it it must mean that you like these episodes, and uh, I I would also like to do more than once a week. But let's uh, let let's see what's possible. It uh, it depends on a lot of things, and it also takes a bit of time for me to prepare these episodes. So it um, I can't do it all the time. Anyway, uh, I am happy for the feedback and the continued support for this series. This is absolutely amazing. So let's uh, see where we are, where we left off last time, and what we did. Let's uh, go back here to our. Oil refining build, I guess. There are, were a few things that were mistakes and uh, they were highlighted, like the blueprint had some junk things out here. And we found out that this part here is actually using more than 1200, which is what one of these can produce. So I have done an extra one, getting the extra line in here and getting it in here. So now these are each taking 900 and it's much more likely, much more successful. There was a power pool misplaced here, so I hope you uh, appreciate that. Uh, yeah, I may not reply to all the comments, but I at least try to read them and respond to them as well as possible. We're now having this in a steady state. There was another good question about so what am I? What's going to happen if I take this one out? And the answer is actually, and I did not uh, describe that adequately. I'm not going to. I'm going to keep this one as it is. This one will be feeding my home base. And at some point, I might get in trouble because the amount of blue circuits built will strain the lubricant. And then I'll just bring in some more lubricant. So that's not a big deal. So this is exclusively for future builds. And this, this lubricant will also be going back to the home base because I know that I'm going to be running out of lubricant. Let's talk about uh, the objective for today because why did we build this? We built this for a number of different reasons. The lubricant is sort of like a... An insurance for later, so that's just going to be there. We have the sulfuric acid and we have the sulfur. Sulfur is for blue science, so we're going to need it. I'm not even going to say soon, but we're going to need it for when we start building the sciences. And then we have the sulfuric acid that's needed for the blue circuits. And the blue circuits are needed so we can build a module production. And a module production is something we need because we don't have enough modules back in the main base. We are down to uh, 300, but we're going to be consuming those 300 very, very rapidly. So it's basically the sulfuric acid we need. Also, sulfuric acid is a prerequisite for batteries. Batteries is a prerequisite for accumulators. Accumulators is how we are going to power our base further down the line. I don't want to have a base that uses exclusively nuclear power. I've seen that that's, uh, even though it's it's not as UPS intensive as you think, if I'm going to build it big, I have to tr transition into solar. And that's going to be a thing we want to do soon-ish. Soon-ish. So that's... Oh, I don't have a train. Hold on. Let me just get my building train in here. That's kind of embarrassing that I forgot to bring a train in for myself. I should have done that before I started talking. Anyway, what we're going to do today is continuing on the teching process of blue circuits. So blue circuits are horrible in a sense, but the great thing about the blue circuits is that it's actually going to activate a lot of our builds. In order for us to activate it, we're going to be using a lot more green circuits this green circuit is pretty much idling because nothing is happening here i'm the only thing i'm using the green circuit for is just bring it back here once in a while and the science is so slow that it doesn't matter so what i'd really want to do and that's like super simple is to do this that's the beauty of of this one and then i'm going to send my builder trance down here and they'll be building stuff hello train oh look at that it switches to manual Otherwise, it would have left immediately. I'm going to build up here. This is going to be where we uh, we will have our new location. I have deliberately not aligned them with these intersections so that they are... They... Yeah. I make sure that I don't have this. So there's a block in between here. There. So I can have a train in here. But if I assign it here, then it's going to be a four-way intersection. The four-way intersections are awful. I could have moved it a bit, I guess. But I didn't. Let's go up here for our build. There we go. Now, uh, why did I build this one again? This makes absolutely no sense. Ha, that's funny. Does it? Oh, no, because everything is moving that way. Is that way. I'm pointing here. You can't see that. Everything is moving this way. So 
this doesn't make any sense. This can make sense because it goes to here. But I think if I build it up here instead, it would be one, two. No. Then the easiest one I could build here. All right. You know what? Just wait a second. I'll be changing these ones to where I actually wanted them to be. And now I've made the change and this should be much nicer. We're going up here and break, 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 break. Okay, so here I'm gonna build it these ones. One, two, three, this will be stackers, this will be stations and this will be production. I am probably just gonna delete this if it's gonna be a problem or maybe move it down here. This is so little that it's kind of irrelevant, but I do think it's like the only thing I have. Oh no, I also have that one. Okay, okay, so this one is kind of, Working. I mean, I'm just going to delete it if it's going to be a problem. Right, so what is it we want to do? We want to start by making the usual things of getting an intersection in here. And now we have our builder trains with us. And let me also just check up on our builder, builder buddies there. I don't think they have enough to build everything, but they, they might, they might. But the main problem is that they take so long for them to charge that as they go out here, everything flies out, everything comes back, and then it spends a bit of time on charging. So you can't sort of just have it walk around because then the little drones will not be charging fast enough. But, you know, I'm going to do it anyway. Now, the thing is, what we need is we need this one because we're going to need a lot of things inbound. So I'm going to start by just taking this part as the inbound. I think that's going to be the easiest thing to us to do there and i'm very happy that it did not connect i don't necessarily think i want as many intersections here i might actually want to do it in a slightly different way such that uh let's see because we're building green science now why am i say green science it's just nothing to do with green science blue circuits and i'm not colorblind i just have a speech deficiency when it comes to mentioning colors in factorio Hmm? Ah, okay. So we can get three in here. I think that's better if I can get three in for the top one. Because the top one will be green circuits. And then it's going to be red circuits. And then it's going to be sulfuric acid. And then it's going to be outbound. And then I have too many. I think we need to just cut this. And just figure out what how we want it anyway. I think I'm not going to need this. Okay. So that would be like outbound, sulfur, sulfuric acid, and red. Yeah, let's do that. And then I'll copy this one. Not you, not you, not you. Here. So that is a setup, and I really like it having it sort of, yeah, this looks so much nicer. Right, so the next question is the station. The station, though, what else do we have? Oh, you have run out of materials. Oh, no, that's bad. That's really bad how they actually ran out of materials and yet they're starting to come in. Okay, anyway, that's uh, something, that's the brilliant part of it, but it's also kind of scary as well. See, this is pretty much what we want. Look at that. This is pretty much what we want already. So could we just copy paste it? I don't know. That's interesting. If I build it here, it would fit so much better. Oops, hold on. Does this fit? It fits perfectly. Good. Yeah, so that's uh, that's definitely that one. There. And then I guess we have to build that as well. Up here. And then I don't know if this is long enough. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Uh, crap. <laughs> Damn. Then, maybe I do want this one. Yeah. 
Yes. And that now goes here. And then it's the whole damn thing up top that has to be moved slightly down. Seems weird to do that. I don't know if... Hmm. What about you? Oops. Where are you? Where are you? You're up here. Okay, you're being charged. That's fine. I am going to cut this part out. Cut this out. And then get it moved down to this location instead. I think that'll that's going to be better. Then I'm going to take this part. Also move it here, and then kill the top one. How exactly is that gonna change anything? I don't know. I don't know how that's gonna change anything. Why, why would that change anything? Because now it's just gonna be exactly the same. It's just gonna be further down. Huh, why did I want that? Oh, right, I did. Oh, crap, yeah, I, I, didn't, I didn't want that, actually. The reason why I wanted that was because then I did not have to go down. So we're going to back here. Good thing we had drones. And then I could do the, the split one in here. Which is exactly what I wanted. There. I'll use this. There. There we go. That was what I wanted. That was the reason why I did what I did when I did it. And I will get my... Here, are you good? You good? You're good, I think. You just uh, get down here fast. Because we do have some issues. And I don't know what the impact will be of that. Okay, so what we have here, we have an acute lack of drones working. That is annoying. Please give me some... Dyson Sphere program drones that don't just run out all the time. Seriously? Right. <clears throat> we can build the rest because everything else is straightforward here. Nope. The outbound and here. Nope, I've ran out of rails. I might add a mod to make my uh, robot ports faster because this is annoying to sit here and wait for that. So let's go over and get more stuff. What more stuff do we know we need? We know we absolutely need more of this stuff over here. And we probably need this as well, but not just yet. Definitely always need this. Okay, let's move on, move back in. This is also has to go out. Okay, this is working. Moving here. And I will be building here. Okay, so... This is good, and this is good. Right, so now all we need to do is get all the other ones in. Let's just uh, actually do the production first, because I, I just said that I want... I knew that I wanted eight, eight belts. Because it's... Yeah, eight green belts, that's really what I want. And uh, now I'm going to give these a bit of a rest, because we're going to look at blueprints here. I'm going to disable you, and then I'm going to go look at my masterclass blueprints. Endgame beacon module circuits. Yes, indeed. There. That's the one. It'll come from up here. What are we going to do about this? Well, uh, we're definitely... Not doing that. There. And then I'm going to flip it. 
like this. So that's four lanes. Yes, that's definitely more something to what we want. And then I have to make sure that the red circuits go on the eastern belt and the western belt. So that means it has to go like this. That's red belts. And then sulfuric acid goes in here. And that one. And then we're going to have this one coming in and the other one coming into the next part. These two will just be jumping over whatever we have. I don't know, like this, one, two, three, four, something to this effect. That's also self-evident. Yeah, this is pretty much it. And then these two. Get an output. Cool. Yeah, this is much more what we want. Cool. I'll take this out and... And then we'll double it because then we have all the belts we need. And I want to make it close so that it connects, but not so close that it gets crowded. Let me think. I am going to have red circuits coming out here. So let's make sure that the red circuits are actually... How is that? Oh, right. right. Uh, let's do that one now. Let's make sure that the red circuit unload. We should have somewhere that it unloads some... This is what we want. This unloader here. This is a good unloader for what we want. None of that stuff there. And sure. Really, that's so far down compared to where I wanted it. I actually wanted it right up here. Hmm. Like, this would be much nicer. But I guess this is our only option because I am bringing it down there. Okay. This is looking good. I will... Okay, Dave Hart, that's definitely not what I want. I want one of these. Just so I know what I'm getting in here. Uh, I need to change the values anyway. And I only need two, so I don't need this entire balancer. just need two belts. I'm just thinking that... If I'm only going to need two belts, do I really need to do all of that crap then? Couldn't I just do this and then... Uh, can I even remember? I know it's like this. I know there's another one for, for this, but I like this. Why do I like it? Because I can remember how to build it. There you go. That's what I want. Yeah, and at this point, it really doesn't matter if it has to go like that. One, two, three. And then I'll take this one. Oh, that looks good. That looks really good. Could I take it one down and I think it'll be better. Yep, I think that's better. In and in. And then I do one more copy over on this side and that will be ever so slightly different. I'm missing some... One, two, three, four. That's the sulfuric acid. This is not connected, so I'll build one in between. This is not necessary. This is not necessary. And then I need sulfuric acid coming in. I don't need a lot, so that should not be a problem. We'll have it out down here. And this will also be exceedingly simple. That one. That one, and that one. Oh, 
Of course. Eh, one. One off there. This is good, this is good. And then we need the outbound and we need this, some kind of liquid unload. Do we have liquid unload anywhere? Well, we do have liquid unload here and this is, I guess, our standardized liquid unload. So let's take that. Definitely make sure that the name here is different. Oops, and that will be sulfuric acid going in there. And then from here, I guess there's no reason not to to build real. We are pretty certain this is how our world is going to look. I like it. This is red. This is sulfuric acid. This is, well, it's not exactly green. So we'll do the green inbound. Yes, please. And then we do need... Why is it above? I don't like when it's above. It's just... It's just incorrect. It's just incorrect. I'm going to need to find the one that is below because that... What? Am I doing all of them above now? What? what what's the... I... <clears throat> Hello, inconsistency. Everything should be below. Yes. Everything should be below. That's how I've, I want it. Except that one. <laughs> yes, so this one is below and from here to there. Yes, please. From this one to that one. Yes. That looks good. That looks good. Yes. So now it's consistent. Input, 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 and then we do the outbound. Outbound. Where do you have a reasonable outbound? This is probably a reasonable outbound. Something like this. We'll take some of these other things out. And that's definitely too much for what we want. Is it though? Yeah. I must have something else that's lower quantity. Not yet, maybe. No, I don't. This one is really low quantity. But the thing is, like, this is 38,000. And each train can pick up 16. So it's actually just two train loads. It could be something like this. Do I like it or don't I like it? I don't know. I think this will have... It's a smaller buffer, but I don't know if the smaller buffer is better or worse. It also means it's loading slower. I don't like this though. Sulfur is going to be, sulfur is going to be used in very very low quantities, so I don't care. But this, mm, well, let's try to make a compromise, where we do stuff like this, yeah. And switch this on. We are happy with what we have right now. I'm gonna get one belt inbound. So the craziness of. All of this is also just not lost on me. Like how much I'm putting into a buffer that is not going to be doing much anyway. There. Take all of this out. Wow. That did not tile very pleasantly. There, and there, and there. Cool. That one. That one. That one. And that was another research. Good. And these are just going to be almost empty blue belts. Sucks. Like, I'm bringing it in and then I'm splitting it out. I'm splitting, splitting, split, 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 split. But it's still evenly split anyway. So I'm going to be happy about that. I will go this one. Even better. And then I'll be getting it into... What?
Perfect. Yes. What about these? Are they good? Is this one working? I think it's working. Yes, perfect. Okay, so that's um, adding more and I guess we'll do some of this. Now we need to make sure that it gets actually gets powered and we need to add some uh, some mod well not some modules. Uh, let's see where is it? There. That's now powered and then we need to add rubber ports. I'm not gonna hit everything with oh I can hit everything with one rubber port. I can indeed. Sweet. So let's do that. That's everything is covered. Perfect. This gets connected. This gets connected. And I still have some problem here. Oh. That does not look correct. This one is definitely missing something. Okay. I have to take this entire thing out. Otherwise, I can't trust that it. it's correct. So you go in here and you go back in there. And that's the reds. Yep. All right. And then the train, I need to get my train so I can get all the stuff that I'm missing. If I power this up, then stuff will come in yet and I'm not ready for that. So what are we needing? We need... We probably need a few of these, a few of these, a few of these. And we definitely need more of what? Let me see if there's anything else. Oh, lights. Lights. The weird thing, right? And anything else that seems to be running out? Nope. Here? No? Okay. All good. We'll, uh, we'll build the rest then. Come on, where are you? There. Lights. And that should actually be everything we need for this build. And we'd roam around. There's nothing not working. Nothing not working. And I am then happy to let everyone come in. This is weird. Like, that's on the lower side. Uh, okay, it's on the lower side again. Okay, right. The What we're missing is the input quantities. This is... Oh shoot, this is not good, right? This is uh, this is really not a lot. How many? This is 32, so we'll just do some calculations. 32 times and 9,600, I guess. Okay, 300,000, that's a lot. Each train is carrying 64,000. And I want a maximum here of I don't know, 200,000? Give me 200,000 in. Maximum three trains. Is maximum three trains? Could actually be maximum of four trains if we wanted to. This one, it's going to have a lot as well. So I'm going to get this to 144. And each train is 64. And a maximum of three trains. Yes, this one is 198. Yep, that's good. And this one is output. It is 32,000 on a train, and I want a maximum of three trains. I actually want a maximum of two trains for this one. That is definitely not going to be the this outbound. It will be a blue outbound. And with all of this done, I think we're actually ready to just fire it up. And how we fire it up, we simply copy, or we simply complete this cycle here, or this, this one. And you can go home. And then I'm standing here waiting for something else to come in. I think it works. I think it works. I think it works. It's going to be glorious when it's all switched on. And our builder trance, they have done what they can. They go up here. What we don't have, though, is since we are now making here, we have three. I think I'd like to have three for each of these. So I am going to find one of these trains, that one. Uh, what are you? Oh, right, that's beautiful. That is just beautiful. Train. No, that's not what I want. I just want to copy the recipe and then I go up here. One, two, three. 
Go out. Go out. I should have done that long ago. And then I bring in more trains. There. There. And now you get the hell out of here. So I can build that one. All right. Let's see. What are we getting? Are we getting this? Nope. Why have we not? Because we, although we have the train, we do not have a recipe for it. Why do we not? There it is. And uh, not until empty. Good. But let's see. The greens seem to go in the right place. This seems to go into on the closer belt and then output in the furthest belt. Closer belt, furthest belt. Looking good. I'm kind of tempted to do this thing. So, so do it. Yeah, okay. Thank you. I'll do it. <laughs> Just to make sure that there's a an extra connection there, though. These two are not connected at all. They could be right there. Oh. And they could actually connect here. Yeah, I think that's actually nice, I think. Just to make sure. I don't think it matters, honestly. I can't imagine that it does. Let's see if it works. How is this one unloading? It's not going to... Oh, it is going to unload, like, extremely fast. Great. And this one will be at 96. So, no lights on? Oh, one light on. Okay, yeah, it can go to 198. And it's also decreasing pretty quickly. And we have blue circuits. How much blue circuits are we actually producing in this build? 25. 25 blue circuits per second. And then, of course, if you want more, you can just step down one more. And then you have more. Um, Yeah, well. Minor gap here. And they will now go slowly, slowly in and spreading out to every single one. But they can't come in more than 25 per second. Of course, this right now it's backed up because of my silly belt belting here. But that also goes back. Oh, hello, train. The question is, obviously, we don't have three trains. Or we don't have enough of the green trains to keep this flowing. But I think we'll have enough for now. If we look at this, this one still requests one. One train? Yeah, that, that makes sense. Do we have anything inbound? N probably not. Oh, we do have. Yes, please. This is going to be super, super quick because we're consuming four, uh, eight full blue belts. Eight full blue belts of red circuits to make blue circuits. I mean, it's no, no surprise that I can't get the numbers right. Look at this. It's just unloading, 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 and it just barely goes upwards. Huh. And here's another. So fear gas it. That should make it. Yeah, this is the one thing, right? It doesn't empty. It does empty pretty quickly. What is this one at? 1675. So no lights on. Perfect. Here, what is this one at? This is at 80,000. And we do have one light on. 80,000. Yeah, okay. It, it makes sense. It wants to have one more, but then it should stop soon. This one, though. I don't think I want this to be as high to be honest and I think I just wanted 120 because the consumption of red circuit isn't that high so we'll do this uh, this is probably more problematic though because we're gonna have like a constant steady supply in here until of course it's gonna run full on this side here how much do we have at this point 2.7 oh yeah 2.7k blue circuits that's amazing I like it and that's pretty quick how we, we build this. And what are we going to use it for? Well, we're going to use it for <clears throat> another build that we'll build over one, two, three. So we're going to have to build something like this. Something like this. You go away and then you will go in here. Something like this. Tree is in the way. Tree is always in the way. And I'm going to have one of these on the top here. So they can actually connect up top as well. And that's interesting. And then I connect the two up top. And then I can make a module build here. That seems like a really important thing to make a module build. It's close to the red, it's close to the green, it's close to the blue. Yep, let's make modules up here. It's also like away from everything else because it might be really busy sometimes, but then be super idle most of the time. Now that's going to be consuming a lot of red circuits. So 
once we fire that up, I think we might need to add more power to our network, at least for the time, for, for now. That's uh, also sort of, if we sort of draw into the future a bit further, I built the blue science, blue circuits, in order to build the module factory, because I'm not actually going to replace this build. And but what I am going to replace is this one, because this is actually the one that consumes the majority of our modules. So if I can replace the modules, then all of my internal blue circuits will go into rocket control units, which will be delivering a much more steady supply up here. And then we'll be uh, basically removing that bottleneck. But this is the most important thing because I this is what speeds up our progression. Once we've done that part, then we're definitely going to be bumping up against our power. And then we have the sulfuric acid so we can make a battery build. Once we have the battery build, we can make a solar power build. And then we can start making expansions out here. I think we're going to be doing some really aggressive expansion outwards so that we can uh, we can claim what my intention is is that everything below will be construction and everything above here will be solar panels oh yeah it's probably going to be like this area just for solar and it'll be this pattern and i just need to figure out a good way to uh, to get that done i my idea is basically to push out these gates these walls and then just start spreading outwards and We'll see. That's going to be like five episodes in the future or something. There's going to be plenty of episodes because, well, as a mega base, it's going to run for a long time. But you got a point. You got a point. I'm just referring to the person who was saying, like, I want more than one episode per week. Because if, uh, if it's going to be like 50 more episodes, then it's going to be a full year. And that just doesn't make sense. I mean, by then we'll have the expansion, right? Right? I don't know. I'll think about it. Let me, let me see. So... For anyone who's still watching at this moment, late in the uh, late in the episode, I will ask you the question: Do you want more than one episode per week? Huh? See, so then I'll just judge whether uh, whether there is actually anyone still watching at this uh, at this moment when we've actually done the build. Of course, then to wrap up, the blueprints are of course available. Always link in the description below if you want to support. There's a Patreon support, but of course, just make sure that you like and subscribe, all that stuff. But, you know, if you want to have your own episodes, then, uh, uh, or just, yeah, just want to support or whatever, then uh, there is a Patreon link as well. Anyway, that's enough of that. I really like the how this looks. This is one of those really beautiful builds that just full belts in and then just a minuscule amount of blue. But we know how precious blue circuits are, so this is a pretty decent. And if you need more, just double it. Thank you very much for watching. And as always, stay effective.